three. As they're angry. Yes. Guessing that I'm almost there. Correct. Freeze him again. Biggest guard you've got, Gaia. Nice. Look at all that purple action. Hell yeah, brother. I think we pretty much got it all. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead. Yoink, 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 yoink. Mods. There you are. Um, let's go ahead. Disassemble that one. Yep, see ya, see ya. Nice. Okay, let's get these last two purple ones. We'll take it. Thank you. Pleasure doing business with you. Pleasure doing business with you. much in the way of herbs out here, I won't lie. That's the ones right here. Go ahead and top off real quick. These will keep. True. I think we're good. That's good enough. Since you're on the way. Wow, 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 wow. Oof. The scenery just like changed. Forget the cold. Think of the sun on your skin. True. all this wow, wow, wow. crazy sacrifice did this 
cracked the inside of the mountain like it was an egg? Yes, yes. Quickly now. I've prepared the way ahead for you. Yes, yes. Quickly now. So you've been in here before? To a point. You'll see. Too funny, man. The one I thought I was taking a little bit too much damage, bro. Yeah. Had that all set up. Damn. Oh, we're good now. Yes. You made a climbing path for me, but left an army of machines for me to deal with. Since when were machines any obstacle for you? If you could fly, I wouldn't have bothered with a climbing path either. Boy, silence. Sunshine and rainbows, that guy. I do tell you. Don't look down. Don't look down. Nope. Okay. Just checking, just checking, y'all. Just checking. Another, like, climb thing there. But, looks like we can just walk right up here. You know we gotta investigate, dude. We gotta investigate. Why is this ledge even here, man? Holy crap, bro. Okay. That's what I do. I investigate things. This is exactly the kind of place I expected to find you in, Silence. Thank you. It's one of many workshops I've constructed over the years. Okay. What's all this? There'll be enough time later for you to ransack this place. <laughs> true, true. What you got for me, big guy? Looks like you're making a lizard there. Iguana. For years, I tried to get through this hatch. I drilled, I burned, I blasted. But we both know that you won't have any trouble getting through. You make it sound like I should apologize. Not at all. It never occurred to me that the way through would not be with force, but with a key. A key in human form. The failure of imagination was mine, not yours. So when did you come here? Looks like you've spent a lot of time here. 19 years ago, a great explosion destroyed this mountain. Gaia's death, your birth. The echo could be heard as far as the claim. Ash darkened the skies. How they fretted in Meridian as they tried to read this omen. The crater burned for weeks, but when it cooled, I was the first to behold what lay within. Over time, the machines closed ranks to protect it. Useful. Soon, no one dared to come here. Except me. Hmm. Why aren't you here? Preparing Gaia? In her message, Gaia said we could restore her, but... After seeing the damage... How could that be? She said any effort to repair her must come after Hades is destroyed. I concur. Rebuilding the terraforming system now might allow Hades to use it as a weapon. Because of Gaia's sacrifice, it has been forced to search for means that are less... convenient. True. But do you think it's even possible to restore Gaia? Well, you know what the cauldrons are capable of. How they fabricate any technology necessary to create a machine. And by the same principle, 
it should be possible to replicate every technology necessary to repair Gaia. But that would take years, and we're counting the time we have left by the hour. True, true. I thought you might actually be here this time. Actually, here. Why? My presence is unnecessary. You don't need my help to pass through this door. You were the one born to do this, not me. True, true. Alright then, going in. It's time for me to head in. Yes. When you find the Master Override, you will gain the power to defeat Hades. Everything depends on you. Again. Okay. Alright. What is he doing here? Yes. <laughs> I need to get going. Yes, you do. I was surprised you didn't have some sort of like, you know, quip. Yes, you do. You need to like really go now. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. All right. Okay, it wants us to go there, but we need to find some stories, man. Okay. Just one data point? Got some loot. Nice. Logging arrivals, Shan Margo. Welcome to Frozen Hell. Population 10. 11 counting Gaia. Don't count your chicken embryos before they incubated, hon. She's still firing up. Travis. It'll be a while before you eat that omelet. I'm vegan, Travis. You think we'd worked in the same secret base long enough for you to notice? We weren't scheduled to shack up here for another three weeks. You realize I just lost 350 kilos Mind of pre code smug comics in transit. Wait, actual physical media? Why didn't you have it digitized? Can't beat the feel of physical media on your fingers. And in here, we ain't gonna be touching a whole lot else. Figured I was gonna pass the time archiving them. What about you? Me? At work, I guess. My task queue stretches out for like three years. There's a lot of sharp edges to round off. After that, I hadn't really thought about it. Oh, <laughs> you will. You what? 30? Reckon you'll be the one turning the lights off at the end. Food for thought, huh, vegan? This sucks forever. Nah, not forever. Just the rest of your life. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. They're not kidding. Man, the rest of their lives. Check this place out. Guess we're jumping off there, huh? Wow, there's a rope that slides down. Something blue down there. Alright, let's do this. Supposed to get over there? Guess I gotta climb up there. Oh, got some healing herbs. Got some healing herbs. Oh yeah, brother, we're full now. Should be the last power cell I need to get to that ancient armor I found. 
Ancient armory, there it is, dude. That's it. One shield weaver box. And 833 XP waiting for us. Just waiting for us. We got to make sure we got the right questicle activated here. Yes, a mountain that fell. Okay. Oh shoot, man, that's pretty cool. That's weird that that room is right there. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Check this out. Check this out. Oh, wait. Oh, oh. Back away from the ice. There's the ledges right there. Right there, right there, right there. That to me is weird. I mean, that is clear as day ledges. Here, here. That's as far as it goes. It's like you drop from there. All right, Let's scope this other side out. Guess that's my way across. Shoot, that's just a waterfall right there. Don't think, Aloy. Just do it. I couldn't have said it better myself. That's crazy. What is that rope there for, man? All right. Oh, glad that's over. True, true. Gotta check this all out. Okay. Oh, we're climbing up. down uh, we can gotta take a look at this down here there's another room upstairs too not this way maybe further up the shaft we got you we got you all right all right This reminds me a bit of the spire. Okay. Holy crap, dude. Check that out. This must have been where they lived. What's left of it? Once this was all enclosed by rock and metal. Gotta look at it, dude, and I don't know why this is open and it's just a big old fat hole right there, man. That's crazy. I mean, you guys, um, that have been watching the channel, been following channel, you know, I'm dreadfully fearful of heights. That's why Spider-Man was so rough. Dude, I won't lie. Record. I just woke up. See the numbers, but can't make up the time. I was dreaming of. Uh, I was giving a lecture in Q Hall. Maybe it was something more shamanistic. I, I don't know. An audience of shadowy faces under a blank, open sky. 
I told them the world ended with a bang. A plague of robots. But the last humans. We went out, not with a whimper, but a whisper. You know, in caves, ending like we started huddled around a flickering glow. The heads of state, the Fortune Fives, the leaders, and lottery winners, and life cults. All of them buried in their little shelters. Some believing they'll live it out some way, somehow, or Elysium, or us here at Gaia Prime. No different. A multitude of tiny societies taking hold, flaring, dying. Some will be beautiful, some horrific, and none of them matter. Short-term civilizations. One last gasp. One last gasp before the long-held breath. Before I wake up, I know the audience is gone. I'm talking to myself, to a quiet planet, a barren sphere. Just Gaia and her long, long dreaming. I hope she won't be lonely. Damn, I wonder if she was the final survivor of the whole thing or something like that. Charles Ronson. Evacuation happens so fast. No time to think things through. No time for goodbyes. There were lines in the medical ward. I told Tom Paik I'd be with him when he went under. But there was one last shipment of parody Sadie zygotes I could get processed if I rushed. I'm still angry at him for forcing me to choose. Angry at myself for... Well, he died alone. And I didn't get the bloody birds of paradise saved either. All the time left in the world now to think. Gaia Prime's locks are sealed. Elysium sealed up, safe and sound. A distance of miles, but it might as well be on the other side of the galaxy. All the beaters and gammas and support staff living their lives. If I hadn't been an alpha, if things had gone differently, I could have been there. Instead, I'm spending the rest of Elizabeth's room. Oh, damn, man. I know it. Who would have guessed? She didn't even get a chance to unpack. I wanted to hear the rest These of what he had to say. Elizabeth's journals. And they're wow. all destroyed. Look at those graphics. Scan them. The focus can rebuild them, but the process is slow. To us, it seems a powerful device, but its engine is tiny and limited. How slow? Days, weeks, years. Concern yourself with stopping Hades and extending the future, and you might live long enough to hear them. So we got some journals actually that are in there. Let's take a quick look. Notebook. We'll have to catch that at a later date. But anyhow, got these dudes scanned. I uh, journals Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Okay. Those guys will go into a databank and hopefully silence is download them and he'll reconstruct them at a later date. Not supposed to crawl through anything, are we? I guess we are. <laughs> the back is up there. in the shrine this crazy dude absolutely crazy I'm not seeing any other data points or anything like that around let's do this 
There's another room that's back there. This is Charles Rodson. I'm logging this six hours after final deployment of Gaia Prime. This morning, an access port seal malfunctioned. Gaia Prime's port seals were designed to close with a seam of less than two millimeters. But this one closed with a 10 millimeter gap. Enough for an energy signature to bleed through. Enough for the swarm to detect this facility. Enough for Gaia to be discovered and destroyed. Enough to end the future we worked so hard to make possible. Unless the hatch servos were manually re-engaged from the outside. I'm now switching to a recording of the event. Well, I'm not going out there. Not what I signed up for. Either we yes. sent someone out, or all of this was for nothing. It should be Liz's decision. So when is she going to get here? She said five minutes. You don't think... Oh, no. Okay, everyone. Oh, wow. She's I've in her armor. I've seal. Gaia? Seal closure at 1.4 millimeters. Confirmed. Elizabeth, no. We'll find a way to bring you back in. That's it's the not armor. gonna happen. The swarm's too close. Really. It's all right. Guy's complete. She'll take care of things from here on out. That's what she does. Not like this. There's so much we- Guys, you know me. I'm... I'm no good at endings. At letting things end, so, um... Well, they all know. Not. So they all know. Happy trails, Liz. True. And uh, see you around. Yeah. Take care of each other, all right? Liz. I'm okay with this. Wow! 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 Go. Goodbye. That was the last transmission of Elizabeth Sobek. She gave everything for the hope of life on this planet. And we are all in her debt. Holy crap, dude. The story. Aloy? The story. She's gone. True. Damn. Really gone. You knew she couldn't have survived, Eloy. And her achievements were beyond exceptional. While her people bickered, she was the one who took responsibility. The only one who could. She was better than them. That's not what I said. She was. You shouldn't be afraid to admit it. Hmm. Not in the way you mean. Can't you just for one moment stop calculating and let yourself feel? She sacrificed herself for her friends, for the future, for life on Earth. Doesn't that stir anything in you? The generosity of it. You're trying to invest her decision with something magical. It was a rational choice, not based on sentimentality. You're wrong. Remember, she knew it wasn't enough for Gaia to think. She taught Gaia to feel, to care, to sacrifice, to believe in life, enough to fight against hopelessness. If it wasn't for that sentimentality, life would have ended. You and I would never have existed. Your argument is sound. I'm sorry for your loss. She said she wanted to go home. Maybe. What? Nothing. It's time to go on. True, true. Search the ruins for the master override. You'd hate it, Liz, but I wrote you a eulogy. I had to try to express all your children. After all Apollo has taught them, they'll think they know everything, but they have to understand what you did for them. How you love the whole world so much. 
with an intensity that was dazzling, bruising, and in the end, it killed you, or you died for it. Different perspectives. No one could keep up with you, live up to you. I, I don't know, maybe if, if, I, if I hadn't taken that postdoc in Joburg, I'm glad you shot down the Lightkeeper protocol in the end. I don't think I could have taken seeing another one of you. I mean... Wow, 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 wow. Elizabeth Sobek. 2.0. There's only one. I miss you. Not so, Charlie. Not so. Welcome to Elizabeth Sobek. 2.0. <sighs> Look, Liz. You are a pretty stand-up gal. I'm sorry you died. If you had a home to go to, I hope you got there first. But this monument Ronson's made to you? Kinda creepy if you ask me. Rest in peace, Liz. Huh, Travis. God knows you earned it. Okay, got one more data point on there. Rest in peace. From Ted Farrell, the guy who did it Hell, all. Liz. I know. I know you're never gonna hear this. That's not the point. You, uh... <laughs> you got to play the savior in the motor all at once this time. Oh, dude, right, let Mark. it go. Wow, and that was it? That was it. Holy crap, dude. All the way to the end. I created these machines that all for money. Try to get into the Department of Defense. <clears throat> Hello, Margo. How are you holding up? Um, Dr. Ronson, I've been getting a lot of messages, unsolicited messages from Ted. Oh, Ted no, I'm Marvel. sorry. See, there it is. With Liz. Creeper. Gone. We've got no one to run interference with him. I'll talk to Ted. He mostly wants updates, constant updates, hundreds of updates on things he knows nothing about. Liz used to field all of his crap. He doesn't understand the systems at all. I was kind of by design, but he's getting pretty sketchy with me. True. We just have to keep him happy. Liz always said, keep him happy. Are you kidding? You ever hear how she talked to him? <laughs> she was managing him, Margo. I mean, maybe I should ignore him. He's buried in his pyramid with the Hola Hola girls and Panta Antimon Cuckoos. What can he do? Hmm. Wow. I wonder what that door is back behind there. That's weird. There's like a hallway here. That's so crazy, dude. No door here. I mean, are we supposed to be coming out this way or something like that? Yeah, they just like dead ends to nowhere and there's just a door there. Okay. Not bad. We got some climbing to do. What are we going to plug into their heads, Les? A whole lot of history? A whole lot of so-called truth? A whole lot of noise? It's not pablum, Les. It's poison. Mm. And Ted, Ted Faro. Faro Enterprises. The one responsible for creating the machines that started eating humans for fuel. Alright. I'm trying to shake and bake through here, really. 
There's another section at the back of the crater. Looks like it survived the blast. Because it was armored, you found the control room. I'm on my way. Okay, no weird paths on this side. Bizarre light in the snow. Yo. Did you just jump that gap? Oh, damn. Ooh, rumbling, shaking. Okay. Force feedback for the win. Okay, what are we doing here? Why are these data points just laying around here? Some crazy Ted Faro. I've, I've been taking a hard look at the project. In the end, it's simple. It's clean. It's clear. Erasure. Addition by subtraction. I can make a better list. With a single stroke, make it all go away. I really don't like the direction this is going. Continue. True, true. This is sketchy AF. Rose. <laughs> sketchy AF. Got that over there. It wants us to go here. I can kiss my you know what. Because we are gonna go and check this out over here. Because that's what we do. Oh yeah, brother. What is this? Nothing? Serious? Oh okay, okay. Well at least we found this. Explored, done, mission accomplished. Out this bitch. Wow, that's open over there. Oh, no, no dying here. Before I could uh, go investigate the side room. Wow, 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 wow. Joy E on the dark side. Search your feelings. You know. 